What's going on everyone? JB here and welcome to my channel. Welcome to another toy hunting adventure video. And in this video, I'm back up in Marietta, Georgia to check out Second Chance Toys. So let's go inside and see what new toys they have in stock. Back again at Second Chance Toys. Always great seeing that sign. So let's go inside and see what they got. So starting off with our Star Wars section, we got some Star Wars vehicles. Here's the Jedi Starfighter. We got some ties. We got this Republic tank as well as the Separatist vehicle. And on the next shelf, we got this TIE Interceptor, looking very cool, as well as this Rancor. We also have Kylo Ren, X-Wing, and we got some more TIEs. Definitely like the look of this TIE Fighter. Let's check out the price. $50, okay. And here we have Boa Fett just chilling on the shelf, as well as some more walkers. We got this X-Wing, and we also have this Turbo Speeder and this Droid Gunship in the box. Very cool. And moving on to the next shelf, we got some more TIEs. We got another TIE Fighter. And we also have another Droid Gunship. And we also have some Star Wars Black Series figures. We got some Luke Skywalkers. We got Din Djarin. We also have this Jump Trooper. Very cool looking figure. As well as another Luke Skywalker. Scout Trooper. Oreo Sings. Palpatine's Guards. And we also have this Boba Fett figure. Very awesome figure. I have this one. And we also have some uh, mini Imperial helmets. We have not one, but two snow speeders. Very cool. Let's get a better look. Nice. And we also have some more Star Wars figures in the bottom. We got uh, Darth Maul, IG 8. We got some clones. Here's Goji. We also have File First Trooper. We also have General Grievous. Very awesome selections they have. And we have this uh, Tank Gunner Clone Trooper. Very awesome figure. Definitely like the design. And we also have Darth Vader, the Stormtrooper Commander. We also have another clones, some more Jedis, as well as droids. We also have Boba Fett. We got Obi-Wan. Definitely a lot of cool characters they have in this section. And there five first. And moving on, we also got some more Star Wars creatures. We got Dewback with Sand Trooper and Ronto with Jawa. And we also have these figures with diorama sets. Very cool selection. Definitely a lot of cool stuff at Second Chance Toys. And moving on, we also have some Micro Machines figures and vehicles. We got some of these holographic figurines. Don't much about them, but they look very cool. And I think this is from the Micro Galaxy Squadron. Can't be too certain. And we have some vehicles. We have Anakin's Starfighter. We got Rancor. We got the Marauder from the Bad Batch. And we also have some of these mini Micro Machine play sets with figures. And we also have some more vehicles. We got the Millennium Falcons. We got Snow Speeders, Y Wings. We also have some Star Destroyers, B Wings. Very cool lineup. And we also have some Kenner play sets. Here's the Hoff play set. And we also have some figures. We got some Adat pilots, some snow troopers, some rebel troopers. We also have Obi Wan. We got Chewie. We got some Dewbacks. We have this Moss Eisley Cantina set. We also have Lando and his uh, spy gear. We got Gregorian guards. We also have Jabba's palace. And we also have some more camp figures down here. And we have a lot of Tauntauns and Bomb the shelf. Very cool. And we got some more Star Wars goodies on top of this shelf. Here we have the Star Wars The Black Series Grogu. Very decent figure. And we also have this Collector's Cup of Darth Vader. We got BB-8. And this awesome looking Jedi Starfighter in this black coloring. And we got the Republic Shuttle. We got this Droid Carrier. We got some Jedi Starfighters. And moving down the case, we got some more vintage figures. We got Palpatine, TIE Fighter... Some Stormtroopers, we got this role-playing blaster, and we also have some Palpatine's Guards, Bow Damage TIE Fighter, and we also have some more play sets over here. And we got some more Star Wars figures in this case. We got some Scout Troopers, some Jawas, Ewoks, we got Din Djarin, Boba Fett, and we got some R2s down the bottom. They even have the date and the names of these on, on the bags, very cool. And moving down, we also got some more vehicles and play sets. Here we have some Liam Falcons. Not just one, but two of them. 
And on top of this case, we got some more creatures. We also got the droid tank. We got some speeders. And this is awesome. We got the AT AT just standing out. And we got another X Wing Starfighter. And we got the Twin Cloud Car. We got the Y Wing Snow Speeder. And we also have the B Wing as well as some more vintage figures. We got Boba Fett, Dengar, R2, C3PO. Very awesome selection. We got another Millennium Falcon. We got the Ewok Village set. And we also have an X Wing. We got the Bow Damage X Wing. And we also got some Star Destroyers as well as this Hoff Generator Attack set. And we got this Death Star set with some cool looking mini figures right here. Very nice. Got another X Wing. And here we have the Arc Wing. And of course, we got the A Wing right here. Very cool coloring. And we also have another X Wing. Another TIE. We also have Jabba. And moving down, we got some loose Black Series figures. We got an awesome selection. We got Han Solo, Luke Skywalker. We got some Stormtroopers, we got Sokotano, we got this Landspeed, we got R2, we got Revan, we got Jedi Revan, Darth Revan, we got Obi-Wan, Anakin Skywalker, we got Gamorrean Guards, some Clone Troopers, very cool selection of loose figures they have. We got some more Jump Troopers, Adat Pilot, Scout Troopers, Artillery Troopers, Man, very cool lineup. Got Stormtrooper Commander. Got Imperial Officers. And we got some more Star Wars figures in these cases. So we've got Obi Wan, Anakin. Got some super battle droids. Again, I definitely like the fact they have like the dates and names on these loose on these bags. It's very cool. And got some more good selection of Star Wars loose figures. Got some troopers. Very awesome. And moving on to the wrestling figure section, they got a wide variety of AEW and WWE figures. You got Dan Housen and Goldust up front. We also have Carl Anderson. And moving on down, we see wrestlers like Honky Tonk Man, Ultimo Dragon, Cesaro, Dean Ambrose, Ric Flair, got Bobby Lashley, Chad Gable. You got Hulk Hogan with the Retro World Championship. You got Jeff Hardy with the United States Championship. Man, definitely a very cool selection of figures at Second Chance Toys. And I see Shinsuke Nakamura. Another Dean Ambrose. Moving on down, we also have another Shinsuke. We got Matt Hardy. We got Jeff Hardy. We got Luchasaurus. Ken Shamrock. Cesaro. Got we got Billy Graham, we got Scott Steiner, Undertaker. Definitely a massive selection of wrestling figs. And here's Samoa Joe and Cesaro. Got Kevin Owens, AJ Styles. We got Braun Strowman, Drew McIntyre. We got Big E. We also got Nurse Samoa Joe. We got Sheamus. Got Nick Jackson. Very nice. And moving on to their Transformer section. They also have a wide variety of Transformers here at Second Chance Toys. We got Bumblebee. We got Transmetal Optimus Primal from Beast Wars. Very cool looking figure. We got Cliff Jumper. We also got a lot of combiners right here. And here's uh, Ultra Magnus. And moving on to this section, I see Prowl. See, 
Definitely a lot of Transformers. Hard for me to really remember all the names, but definitely a lot of cool looking figures. And here we have Blaster. Got another Bumblebee. And we also got Ratchet. Got Jazz. Got Silverbolt right here. A very cool looking figure. Also a very cool character on Beast Wars. Got some more combiners. We also have Megatron right here, I believe. Got Optimus Prime back. And we also have some classic uh, G1 Transformers as well as their boxes. Very cool to see. Got Cyclonus. Got Devastator. And here are some of the Seeker vehicles. Still would like to get uh, some of these right here at some point. Got Starscream. Got some more boxes. The very cool box arts they have. And then on down. See there, Optimus Prime. Some more very cool figures. Here's Rodimus Prime or Hot Rod. And checking out this section, here we have Megatron from Beast Wars. We also have Anime Bumblebee. We also have Ultra Magnus from Transformers Robots in Disguise. Got Starscream. And there's Prowl. We also got Bulkhead, and here's uh, Transmetal Megatron from Beast Wars, and also we have an Iron Man. Awesome. And moving on to their Marvel section, we got some Spider-Man, we got the Thanos Bank right here. We also got some vehicles. And moving down, we got a lot of Marvel Legend loose figures. We got Nick Fury, Jean Grey. We got Jackal, we got Rogue, Electro, Beetle, got Mr. Fantastic, got another Jackal. Also got Hercules, got another Mr. Fantastic, we got Thorn back, as well as our Munger. Moving down this shelf, we got an AIM Soldier. We also like we got a couple figures got knocked down a little bit. Also not bad. And here's Hawkeye, another Mr. Fantastic, we got Iron Man. Definitely good selection of loose figures they have from Marvel Legends. We got some Craven the Hunters. We got First Appearance Wolverine. And we also got MCU's Nebula. We got Hobgoblin. We got Wendigo. We got Dark Beast from Age of Apocalypse. Here's Red Hulk. We got the Age of Apocalypse Colossus. We got Watcher. We got the movie's Hulkbuster. Very cool looking figure. And we also got Mr. Knight from the Moon Knight series. We also have Wolverine, Captain America, Gamora, Shocker. We also got Black Panther. Got Logan. Movies Electro. Got another Mr. Knight. Got Mantis. Got Cosmo. Very cool. And moving on down, we also have some carded superpower figures. Well, it's nice to see these. Got Flash. We got Batman. We got I've keen Batman, both mask and unmasked versions. And we also have some vehicles and even some prototype figures in the back. It looks very cool. Awesome. And checking out their DC section, they got a lot of Batman figures on this shelf. We got some Batman, Robin, Joker, Batgirl, even Jim Gordon. They have a lot of good selection of figures from Batman. We also got Catwoman. And we got some more DC figures down here. We got Superman. We got Power Girl. We also have some Green Lantern, Red Tornado, Hawkman. Here's Firestorm. We got some more DC figures in this case. Got Cyborg, Batgirl, Supergirl. We got some more down here as well. We got some more Batman, Superman, Jim Gordon, Nightwing. It's a cool selection. We also got any monitor. We also got some red lanterns, doomsday. 
You also got Solomon Grunny right here, very cool looking figure. So is King Shark. Some more Hawkman. Checking out the Power Rangers section, they got a lot of great selections of figures and swords. In fact, I even did pick up a Power Ranger sword from this case before this recording, so you will be seeing that later on. But anyway, we have a lot of great selection of figures from My Morphin to RPM to Zeo to In Space. And here we have the villain section down here. We got King Sphinx, we got Goldar, Snizzard. We also have Mesogog from Dino Thunder, Piranha's Head, Minotaur. And here we have some of the Zords. We got the Shogun Megazord, the Thunder Megazord. We got a lot of Falcon Zords and even the Ninja Zord and even the Power Blaster completed. Very awesome. And moving on, we got some Zoe kits. Here's the Elephander. We got some more Power Ranger Zords. And we also have this Lego-like set of My Morphin Black on his cycle. Very interesting. And we also got this Power Ranger Morpher Coaster set. Also looks very cool. Here's the Transaurus Power Coin. Nice. And we also have this uh, Zoid kit. We have the Dark Spiner. Definitely like the look of the design of this Spiner. Very awesome. And we got some more Power Ranger figures and vehicles. And we also have this picture of Bit Bat Beetleborgs. Remember watching this series as a kid. Very awesome series. And we got some more Lightning Collection figures. And we got some of the vintage Power Ranger flipping head figures, as well as some villains. And here we have some Gundam figures. We got Ultron Gundam, Dom Tropin. And we also have some loose Power Ranger figures down here. Here's Lightning Collection Zeo Yellow. And this is something I was looking for, the basic RPM Black, but this one's kind of chipped and doesn't have all of its weapons, so I'm going to hold back on this one. And we have some more Power Ranger Loose figures. Here's some more Lightning Collection Loose figures, and here we have some in the boxes. We got Phantom Ranger, Metallic Red Ranger, another Phantom Ranger, and down here we also got some more Loose Power Ranger figures down here. Awesome. And checking out the turtle section, we got a lot of great selection of Ninja Turtle figures. Uh, here's this Green Beret Raphael. I'm very tinned about wanting to pick up that figure. And we also have some more. Here's Baxter Stockman. We got Surfer Mikey. We got uh, Stored Shell Raphael. We got Future Toid. We got this Detective Donatello figure. Very cool figure. Had that back when I was a kid. We also have Toka on the back as well as Sailor Michelangelo. We got Leonardo's. And we also have some turtle plushies. Here's Santa Raphael. We also got the transformation uh, figures of Toka Razor, Giant Size Turtles, Mondo Gecko, the Skateboard Vehicle. And moving down, we got the NECA 2 pack of Shredder and Krang. We got some miscellaneous Ninja Turtle figures. We got some Mousers. And we also have these uh, Ninja Turtle cards as well as bios. Very interesting. And we have this Unmasked Dantel plush. And we got some more NECA figures down here. We got Triceraton. We got Movie Splinter. And here's this Baby Shredder right down here. Very awesome. And we got Muckman. We got the Frogs. We got Ground Chunk. Triceraton. And there's Super Shredder. As well as more Ninja Turtle cards. And even Giant Size Mikey. And moving on to the Gargoyle section. We got some NECA Gargoyles. As well as some Vintage Gargoyle figures. Here's Goliath. Brooklyn. Definitely need to continue on with uh, picking up some more NECA Gargoyle figures. And even tend about one to pick up the Vintage ones. Very nice selection. And moving on to the mask section, we got some figures and vehicles. Here's the truck. And we also got this helicopter. And we also have this van. We also got this truck right here. I've never seen this one before, so this is the first time I've seen this. And we also got the race car. We got the Jeep. We got some more figures. We got this purple car. Very tinted I want to pick up this muscle car. Definitely like the color scheme and the flame decals on here. Looks very awesome. That's when we've got some jets. And moving on to the Thundercat section, we got some Thundercat figures right here. Here's Lano, Panthro. We got some of the mini figures. Here's Tigra, Wally Kid and Wally Cat, as well as the villains. We got Mumra's in the back. And finishing up, we got some He-Man figures. Here is He-Man, Prince Adam, Skeletor, Trapjaw. Very awesome selections. And there's Merman, Moss Man. And moving down, we have more Moss Man, Man at Arms, Stinkor, Evelyn. 
And we also got this web pack in the back right here. Very cool. And we also got some more Ram Man, some Men at Arms. Okay, also got some more vehicles as well as figures. Got Buzz Off. Too bad. Got Battle Cat as well as some more Master Universe figure uh, vehicles and figures. Here's Skeletor. He Man. Got Ram Man. Very cool. It's got Sun Man, more He Man, and the cats. Awesome. So that wraps up my trip to Second Chance Toys, and it was great to be back over there at the shop again. Um, they definitely did some reorganizing from my last visit, and they had a lot of great selection of vintage and modern toys in stock. That I had a fun time. If you're ever in the Marietta, Georgia area, definitely check out Second Chance Toys. They had great staff. They have a great selection of figures. It's definitely worth checking them out. And of course, I did pick up a Power Rangers sword, and it's actually a Super Sentai version of this. So I picked up the Kyoruger Zakutor. Now this is a lot different from the Dino Charge Raptor Zord as this one is a lot larger and it has a lot more detail on the toy. And of course included with this is the battery, but the number, the logo, and even the name has seen some better days. But it is what it is. I'm happy to get this and I'm hoping to find the rest of the Cure Ruger Zords in future toy hunts. So thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, please do me a favor and give this video a thumbs up. And if you are interested in any of my future toy hunts, feel free to subscribe. So once again, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you guys all have a great day, and I will see you on next one.